In this model of the scapula, you can see most of the rotator cuff muscles on the posterior view. Actually, on the top view of this model, you're going to be able to see the supraspinatus muscle that originates in the supraspinous fossa and goes all the way to insert in the greater facet of the greater tubercle, or the superior facet of the greater tubercle, as we can see here in pink. Okay? Uh, the function of the supraspinatus muscle is actually to initiate uh, abduction at the shoulder joint. You can see there the insertion of the supraspinatus muscle. The supraspinatus muscle initiate abduction up to about 15 to 20 degrees of abduction and then the movement is completed by the deltoid muscles that will allow the humerus to go into full abduction up to about 90 degrees. And again, that is the main function of the supraspinatus muscle. Abduction for the first 15 and 20 degree, and the insertion is the superior facet of the greater tubercle. And you can see, as we rotate the model, the origin on the supraspinous fossa.